One of the questions I get a lot is, George, how do I stand out in a crowded online marketplace? How do I become unique for my audience so that they'll want to keep watching my videos or reading my content, etc.? Well, let me use the analogy of well, how would you stand out in a physical crowd? Let's say a friend was looking for you, okay, and you're in a crowd where actually probably many people are even dressed like you and some people might even look like you, but your friend can spot you quickly because she knows your face. Your face is familiar to her. Maybe the way you stand or the way you walk or the way you dress, something about you is familiar to her and she can spot you in a crowd like that. Same thing with our online audience. By repetition, we become familiar. And by familiarity, they decide, ah, you are unique to me in that I recognize you, I'm used to you, I watch you, I enjoy what you say. Remember I said it's like a friend looking for you in a crowd? Well, in the online space, we're not trying to please everybody, right? In marketing, we're not trying to please everyone. We are trying to reach just our true fans. The people who, when they encounter us, there's something about us that resonates with them. I call it an energy signature, but you can call it personality matching, you can call it, you know, alignment of values um, and ideas. But basically, your true fans are people who, when they first encounter you, there's something about you. You don't even have to try. And that's my second point, is that you don't have to try to be unique. Just by you opening your mouth or putting pen to paper and writing about your life or about your thoughts on, on your industry, just by opening your mouth you are already unique because nobody has lived exactly your life. Nobody has exactly had the same experiences, the same challenges, the same learnings, the same conversations you've had for many years. Nobody's had that combination. Nobody has that combination of your personality and your way of talking and, you know, the, the challenges you've been through, etc. So, just by opening your mouth and having that conversation with your audience, you become more and more unique over time, just like when your friend talks to you, the more she talks to you, right, the more you become unique to her because the, the, the more she learns about you and vice versa. So the takeaway message, if you show up consistently based on repetition and familiarity and based on exposure to your ideas and your personality, you will become unique by doing that. So care enough about your audience, about your topic, about the process of improving your, your, your connection with your audience by showing up. Love them enough to show up consistently. I hope this is helpful. I'm George Cow, Authentic Business Coach. I love talking about creating authentic content and doing authentic marketing to grow your business and stabilize your income. If you like this video, you'll probably like my other ones too. So I'll see you in the next video. Take care.